What's up? What's good? How y'all doing, man? It is your boy, Killer Minute, checking back in with another video. Welcome back to the channel. If you are new, y'all already know the three things to do right now. You don't? I gotta tell you. For real? Come on, man. You you gotta know this by now, man. Like, comment, subscribe right now, man. You know what I'm saying? The three main things you do when you click on somebody's video. Like, comment, subscribe, man. Um, share this with your friends, man. Like I said, 2022, we going up. Everybody's going up. Everybody should go. I want to see everybody up winning. You know what I'm saying? Big houses, nice cars, all that, man. Uh, today's video, man, is going to be a Q&A. You know what I'm saying? I put a, I put a, uh, a thing up on my story on Instagram. If you haven't followed me, go follow me right now. Killer made it 32. Uh, question asking thingy on the, uh, on my story about a couple of days ago, you know what I'm saying? I'm just getting to the video, but about a couple of days ago and uh told y'all ask me some questions. Now I got ten questions on here that y'all have asked me, so I'm gonna answer them. Um and we go we gonna get it together, man. But like I said, before we get into this video, like, comment, subscribe, man, share the video with your friends, run it up. Go watch my last video that I dropped like a couple weeks ago, man. It's, it's just me cooking up like a little cook up session, you know what I'm saying? So go do that, go run that up. Yeah, let's get into the video. All right, first question. What made you start making music? Man, that's a good one off the bat. But uh, I, I was just always one of the kids, like, in school, you know. Um, got the pencils, desk, you beating on the, uh, you know what I'm saying, beating on the desk and everything. Like, I was always one of them kids. I always got in trouble for, for like, beating on the desk and, and just taking everybody's pencils and pens and trying to just make beats, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was, I was one of them. Even when I got home, it was the same thing. Like, just trying to make beats, trying to, you know what I'm saying, get better at the, the you know, at the, the table beats, I guess you can call them. And, and I, you know, I just kept going with it. Like, real talk. And the, the love for it. Like, I just always loved music. Different types of music. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was never... It was never just, oh, I like rap, ooh, ooh. I mean, that was the main genre I liked, but it was like, you know what I'm saying? I liked the R&B, I liked the, the Michael Jackson, the pop. I liked the, you know what I'm saying? Like, even a couple couple of uh, country songs, you know what I'm saying? I liked, I, I really got that with you know? Um, that's what got me, like, into the music, the love, and just always wanting to make beats just here hear somebody on my beat to hear somebody be like man turn that woo woo on knowing I made the beat you know what I'm saying so yeah next question man who got you into doing music who got me into doing music my pops got me into doing music man shout out my dad you know what I'm saying if it wasn't for him I probably wouldn't even be where I'm at today you know what I'm saying cause he didn't he didn't turn me on to the Fruity Loops. He didn't got my setup going. Uh, like everything that he had, he gave to me. So shout out to him, man. Like he a real one. Um, but the pops got me going on the music, on the music stuff. You know what I'm saying? Just just sitting back doing the uh, the table beats. Like the, in the last question, um, he he heard me all the time. It was just like when we moved, you know, because we ended up moving from our house. Like when I started doing that, uh, he was like, "We go, we gonna get the FL, and I'm gonna show you how to do it." Cause he was already getting it, you know what I'm saying? Before he heard me doing this, but uh, he we we went and got that <clears throat> once we moved. Excuse me. We went and got that once we moved and everything, and, and he showed me how to do it, and I've been been in it ever since. Like I've been on and off. Back in 2020, I really started taking it serious, but I still been kind of on and off with it. But, but I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm in there, though, you know, like learning a lot. I didn't know it was like this much to make it beats, like for real, for real. But, um, uh, I'm learning a lot. I'm, I'm, I'm getting it. I'm, you know, and we you know, turn it up. You know what I'm saying? So y'all stay tuned. Turn your post notifications on. Like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah. Next question, right? Do you work with a lot of artists? As of right now, no. I didn't work with like, at least, I'm gonna say like seven to eight artists. Um, the main artist I work with right now, that's my brother, his name is uh, Peso. We, we got some shit in the works, you know what I'm saying? We, we working, we, we getting it together. Um, 
but not not really too many artists you know what i'm saying i'm trying to get my skill down I'm trying to get my niche down or whatever and uh and just just get better at it i want to and like in the future even like right now like i want to like y'all are the artists that want to work with me producer or whatever yeah man you know what i'm saying instagram they made it 32 uh and like let's work you know what i'm saying like i i've been you know i feel like i've been getting better on my end so I just feel good all around. I wanna, uh, I do wanna get back in tune and, and get to working with more artists and, and just moving around and doing stuff like that. So, you artist, rapper, singer, whatever, get in tune with me, man. Like I said Instagram, Killer Made It 32. Let's get it. What is your favorite thing about the music? Mm. Well, my favorite thing about the music is the journey that I'm on right now. You know what I'm saying? Just, just the grind you gotta put in, the, the work you gotta put in, the, the, the everything. Like, yeah, it be it's bad times and it's good times, but the journey is is everything in my opinion. From what I've been going through and all that, like the journey is everything. Like, just getting to see the new cities and meet new people and uh, you know what I'm saying? Just, just all the, the little things. That, Things that's gonna help you, you know what I'm saying? And, and you have to build relationships. That's another thing I like about it. Just the relationships within the producers, the, the artists and the producers, the engineers, you know what I'm saying? Like, like one day I want my own team, me, my brother, uh, uh, engineer, and just more producers and artists, you know what I'm saying? Just one day I just gonna come. So, y'all you know, stay tuned for that. But, but just the journey and the, the relationships that you build with people, you know what I'm saying? I, that's my favorite part about it, you know? Um, I look at it like music. I like the money part. Uh, I got kids, so yeah, you know. But like me, I just love to make music. I just love to sit here and make music um, and do all that, you know? Yeah, that's my favorite part, though. Like the journey and the... Uh, journey in the relationship you do. How do you feel about roots slash mix? I mean, if you, if you rock with them, then you rock with them, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I didn't, I didn't got to the point where it's like, I don't care what other people think. Like, if I, if I want to make a MIDI, or if I want to use a MIDI or a loop, that's what it's going to be, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not, I don't care if people think like, oh, you didn't do a loop and, and you didn't do this, and you like that. That's that's you. You know what I'm saying? Like that's not me. So me, like I'm I'm with it. Like I, you know, you use it, you because it do spark ideas and stuff. So you go use it, use it. If not, then get out the way. You know what I'm saying? Where do you see yourself in music in the next six months to three years? That's a good question. Um, really, like the next six months, I see myself working with new artists. I see myself traveling a lot more. I see myself making a little more money. The next three years, uh, moved out of my home, my home city, uh, in the studio all the time, just working, grinding, you know what I'm saying, and just getting to it, you know. And, and it's, it's going, to me, it's going to come true. So, like, we just got to keep working, keep grinding, keep moving forward. What are your goals for 2022? Um, just the same thing, touching on the last question. Uh, get, being in the studio more, just working with new artists, getting my, my brother's tape going, you know what I'm saying? Because he's trying to drop the tape here soon, so trying to get that going, trying to put that in motion. Um, traveling a lot more, getting around to meet new people, and, and just, just doing all that type of stuff, you know what I'm saying? Meeting, like I said, meeting new people, just seeing new things, better things, learning new things as far as music go and everything. Yeah, that, that's, those are my goals, really. And staying true to myself, man. Like, real talk, staying true to myself. So, yeah. Last question. What do you want to change about your music in the new year? That's a good one right there. For, for, uh, what I want to change about my music is just just staying consistent, being consistent with, with making beats, being consistent in the studio, being consistent, just being consistent, you know what I'm saying, if that makes sense, but 
really is just consistency for me. Like, if you stay consistent, you can be whatever you want to be. You know what I'm saying? I want to be great with the beat. So, I'm just going to stay consistent, keep working, keep moving forward, keep doing what I do. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like I said, me and my brother, we work on trying to come up out of our town and everything and just get, get to where we want to go. And we, we've been working, we've been trying to Yeah, like those, those are, that's what I want to change about my mute. Just being consistent, bro. Like, just, just, that's it. Just being consistent. Because I, I haven't been consistent since, really, since I started this, which is like six, seven years ago, you know? So, just being consistent and staying on my stuff. Get, get more organized, too. Just being more organized. So, yeah. That is my QA video. Um, appreciate y'all clicking on the video. Like I've been saying, like, comment, subscribe, uh, share with your friends, you know what I'm saying? Turn the notifications on because we got more vlog, uh, studio vlogs, just regular vlogs. We got, we got content coming, man, you know, so I need y'all to uh, turn your notifications on right now. Go follow me on Instagram at killermated32, killermated32, K-I-L-L-A-M-A-D-E-I-T-3-2. Um... Go follow me, you know what I'm saying? I'll be dropping samples and, and just all types of stuff on my Instagram, pictures and everything. Uh, let's run it up. Let's get it in. Let's go. Uh, it is your boy, Killer Mate, and I'm checking out. Peace.